Hello, my perfume lovers, Ares, fanática de, de, uh, fanática de perfume como yo. Okay, <laughs> sorry about that. I had to put some brakes on that. <laughs> so this video today that I have for you um, is my top 10 favorite vanillas. So I love vanilla. It's one of my favorite, if not my favorite nose in perfume. I just love it. I feel like vanilla is something very appealing it can be sexy it could be playful it could be just fun it could be comfy it could be cozy it could be a lot of things and um it i feel like some vanillas can be um year um how do i say year long that's not what i'm trying to say um you know you could wear them all year um some of them are a little bit heavier and they're so sweet that they do better with the you know cooler weather you know, in the cold and things like that. So, um, so I'm going to have my variety here. This was very tough. This could change, you know, next week or in two weeks when I receive, you know, if I get more fragrances and, you know, um, but this is how I feel for now. And these are my favorites. Okay. So let's get into the first one. Okay. The first one that I have here is Kayali Vanilla 28 very much loved in the fragrance community and outside of the fragrance community this is pretty known um now by now you know i've you know i had some people that have bought this because of uh you know i my you know encouraging them to try it because it's just such a beautiful vanilla it's not complex it's not crazy but it's just beautiful it's like a the basic vanilla that you have to have if you're going to looking for a really nice vanilla fragrance and you're just starting out this is you this is you right here this is beautiful a lot of people complain about longevity um i don't have problems i over spray of course i do my 15 to 20 25 it depends i do my lotion and everything so this one lasts me all day and i've had a lot of people say that it lasts them also so that is that okay that's that the next one that I have here is from Jovoy. It's called Remember Me from Jovoy. This one is a lactonic, not so lactonic. It's a tea fragrance, but it has tea. It has milk. It has, um, of course, vanilla. And it just is comforting and is beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. I love this, okay? Oh, I think it has cardamom also. So it has some spices in there. So like a little bit of lactonic, a little bit of spice, a little bit of vanilla and everything nice. I'm just kidding. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> okay. The next one that I have here, I'm going to try to mix this up because, okay, is Vanille Absolute by Montau. I am sorry about the fingerprints. I always try to take that out. So Vanille Absolute, this, of course, if you know about Montau's, they are be small they last really long most of them are really really be small so this is like um i had a sample of vaniglia by Masilari, and they smell really 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 similar so if you try that one and you think oh my god it's too expensive and this and that um montals you can actually this is niche but you can find them um for discounted prices i mean check fragrance night joma shop um where else i bought a lot of them on ebay believe it or not and they have come often just make sure that has the money back guarantee on ebay and you'll be good yeah so this is just pure vanilla but it has cloves and i'm not sure how this if it has cinnamon since i'm sick i'm not gonna spray it but this is just a pure vanilla and it's gonna go all day okay that's that the next one that i have is vanilla royale by kayali i love the gold bottles i love the kayali bottles they are really cute so this one is so good I'm, the notes are on the back so it has vanilla sur absolute golden rum creme brulee brown sugar royal oud sugar patchouli <coughs> excuse me i don't have any problem with oud i don't have any problem with patchouli but i don't feel like it's so strong um maybe the patchouli is more no, like you can smell it more here than the actual oud and it's just i just get a very in the beginning i get a lot of rum 
and then um in the base you have the vanilla from the vanilla 28 in the base with the rum and this just oh, is beautiful i can't i probably i'm probably going to wear this for um for christmas christmas eve okay the next one that i have here is burberry goddess why are people hating her she's so good and this is not basic at all to me this has lavender and vanilla um the caviar and the, um i think it has ginger too oh this is really good look at that look at that this is a one ounce but um it's getting scary okay this is a really cute bottle and it is really good don't go smell it oh to go smell it don't believe what people say this is boring it's basic it is really nice sometimes designers have good fragrances you just gotta you know you just gotta check them out check them out okay the next one i have is vanille dory by alexandria but this is the imitation for spiritus dubla benin by guerlain um which is a smoky balsamic you know um smoky um and what boozy boozy vanilla so and it's smoky oh i love the smokiness in this vanilla it's beautiful okay that is that and then the next one that i have is an affordable gem which sunny from sunny sense brought to my life lalique le parfum okay look at that this is a beautiful different vanilla it is very different and I love it so much. I'm going to put the nose up. I think it might have licorice. It's just so good. And longevity is good and everything. Affordable gem, okay? The next one I have is what I have left of Alien Essence Absolute by Mugle. One of my favorite. And if you've been watching my channel, you know this is a beautiful. It has the original Jasmine from uh, the original Alien but it has the myrrh and it has the incense and it has this minty menthol smell to it also with the vanilla in there which look how dark that stuff is and it's just beautiful it's intoxicating and addictive <clears throat> and i have the juliana's um scarlet letter dupe which is a really good dupe because that is discontinued and it goes for crazy prices on eBay or whatever they want. Like, it's crazy. It's No, it's too much. The next one I have is Honey, which is the imitation by for Annie by Nishane. Um, this one is another Alexandria fragrances. I recently talked about dupes or that video might come out after this one. All the different dupes and, the, and how I feel about them. This is a great dupe. I love Annie. This is like they say green i don't really get green that's not really what i get from it but it's just a it has that spice it is aromatic it is so so good i love it and longevity is great 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 <coughs> i did try the original ani so that's a great dupe when i say it's a great dupe believe me okay and then this one is another dupe is vanilla baby by dua this is the imitation for, um, oh my God, I just went blank. Baby, baby, baby. Baby, baby, baby. For <laughs> Baby Cat. It is the imitation for Baby Cat by YSL. I had a moment, excuse me, this always happens when I film. I go like blank. I go like, okay. So yes, this is a spicy. When I say spicy, I'm talking about like black pepper to the max. Okay, when you get when you spray this, you get those the black pepper and all of the the, the spiciness, but like boom, it's in your face. You're going to sneeze, all of that, but then the vanilla in the dry down is beautiful and I love it. I really at first I did not uh I did not like it cuz I had a sample and I didn't um I didn't like it, but then I tested it again and I was like, hmm, wait, hold on. And then I was like, oh, I like this. And so the dupe search began and here it is. So that is that. Those are my top 10 favorite vanillas for this moment. I love vanillas. They're so comforting and beautiful. Um, let me know if you have any of these. What do you think? 
And yeah, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Put your notification bell on so you don't miss my videos. Until next time, bye.